Hey, what's up guys? Back to you guys with another video and in today's video, I'll be talking to you how to start a laundromat. How to start your laundromat. You know, laundromats remain the most profitable businesses out here. Like, <laughs> it's an underrated business. Not many people know about laundromats. Not many people are into it. The competition is not that much. And, you know, that's where Asians, Chinese, they take over the area because most of the laundromats currently in Canada and the US, I see a lot of Chinese, you know, and eat. And it's what we call fast cash because it's, it's direct money. So um, please, if you love the content I'm pre I'll, be, I'll be doing for, to motivate me, I just want you to share and subscribe. And let's get straight into this video. So to begin with, um, for for you to start any business, it has to do with capital, you know. And now, with regards to laundromats, those are businesses whereby banks, the acceptance rate of loans, you know, banks, once you move to a bank and you want to take a loan on that, immediately they give it because the success rate, most banks, the success rate is about 80%. With regards to laundromats, like I'm speaking of 80%. So as a starting capital, I always advise people to start with approximately uh, from $50,000 to about $100,000. Because to begin with, the equipment, I'll, adv I'll advise you guys to look at more equipment from um, Alibaba or LG. They have the best in terms of machines. So um, if you don't have the capital to start, because, you know, the hardest part with that, it's, 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 it's more of the capital. Once you have the capital to start your laundromat, bro, you, you're going to kill it. You're going to kill it. So you start by creating your LLC. You have a business plan. You can go in towards banks. No matter what, you set appointments. You speak with them. They're gonna give you a. They're gonna give you. They're gonna approve your loan, but I think deposits. You have to make at least a deposit of close to fifteen thousand dollars before they can give you a loan. And with laundromats, you have a lot of equipment, and you can sell a lot of laundry detergents. And also, there's something about laundromats I love. One of the best things I love about laundromats is you you have two types of customers you have um the people the individuals you know who want to do laundry on their own like they don't want to waste time with their electricity then then you have companies you have big multinational companies you know that especially hotels uh, 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 I've, I've seen security companies, construction companies. Yes, the equipment for construction, they will never tell someone to go and wash it at home. So a lot of construction companies, restaurants, you know, they wash all their, most of their stuff at the laundromats. So it's it's like you, you're going to have customers too. You no longer want to have customers. Like every blessed day, you're going to be having customers and customers. Like This is a cash printing business. I love this business, man. This is an underrated business. The competition is not much. And now with laundromats, it's your location. If you have a good location, I always speak of location. If you have a good location for your laundromat, I bet you, you're going to be great. And sometimes it's not even a matter of location because people are always going to drive. Once your laundromat is clean, it has space. You create a good relationship with your customers. You create a good relationship in the neighborhood. You print your billboards. And also, I'm just going to dedicate a next video into how to promote your laundromat. So, this is just like an introduction. And I would love that you check the other videos. And those other videos, I'm going to go into details how you can start your laundromat business, how you can promote, and also sometimes how you can even buy because there are a lot of companies that are ready to sell their businesses. There are a lot of 
businesses for sale, laundromats businesses for sale. This is a niche that it's extravagantly uh, uh, um, fresh. It's completely fresh. Not many people are talking about it. Not many people are even looking at it. A lot of people just come, you pay and you go, bro, like... I'm telling you, it's a fast printing machine. And just imagine you have six locations and you have people that are... Because I met a lady. She makes close to $40,000 per month from her laundromat. That's how much her laundromat gives her, man. Like, laundromats are the most... I don't know where to start, man. Because if you're watching this video, then you know you it, it, it has potential. Are you understanding? But please don't forget to like, comment, and share. And I'm going to give you more tips on how to start your laundromat business. Because right now, it's actually one of the most... It's a, it's a very liquid business. It's a very liquid business. You can create memberships. Your place has to be clean. You can even start selling detergents. You can be in partnership with uh, um, very big soap brands because a lot of soap brands come and advertise in laundromats. So once you have a good laundromat, I bet that um, a lot of, uh, of companies are going to contact you for advertisements. So um, I believe um, starting a laundromat in 2023 you know it's one of the best things you can do you know you have personal drivers you can hire drivers that come over and take um laundry from people's houses you work in partnership with big companies you know especially construction companies because they have a lot of construction equipment after work they have to go and watch them so they will not love to just go back home and you know watch them so sometimes you know you can create a lot of services with them you have subscribers per month you can tell them that no you send people you know that's when you over one work with you don't you don't have to do all that because with laundromats the money comes towards you it comes towards you you don't even go towards the money the money comes towards you so um if you're looking into starting the laundromat i i can create a i'll create a blueprint and put in the description below you know how to especially to promote in your laundromat paying taxes you have to know how to hire accountants you know you you also need some a bit softwares for websites and everything you know you can just shoot me an email if you like if you like what you're seeing right here if you like the information i'm giving you you can shoot your email i partnership with you and i we work together on how we can you know, we can start our laundromat, we can promote your laundromat, we can make you grow, we can, you know, give you the best accountants, where to hire the best people. I can partnership, I can be your partner, we can work this out together, because I bet you this is a business that it's never going to die down. Why? Because we human beings, we are lazy. Are you understanding? We are all lazy. People say, no, but... People just buy laundry mats. Uh, you just need to buy a washing machine at home. Yeah, thousands of people have washing machines at home, but they just prefer to go to the laundromat because one, you know, some laundromats, you meet people, you can also meet a be beautiful ladies there in case, you know, a lot of people have different reasons for coming to laundromat. Like, like me, for example, my elder brother, me and my elder brother, we just used to go because it was our time together on Saturdays. <laughs> we just go to the nearest laundromat by and we discuss. We just want to do shopping. We just want to go out. So I give this business a hundred on a hundred. And this is actually one of the most profitable businesses right now. Once you're, you have the right um um once you have the right um the right direction the right uh way the right path once you're placed in the right path i bet you man you're not gonna regret this business you know i'm gonna put more information out on how you can grow your laundromat what are the best locations if you're in canada if you're in europe if you're in the u.s if you're in Wherever you are, you know, I'm going to teach you how to do it. You know, 
you have tutorials the best machines out where to get the best machines from import duties export duties the taxes you have to pay employing and all the like but i can assure you that this business is a printing it's a liquid business do you know the meaning of liquid liquid means it's <laughs> you're printing money man you're printing serious cash for yourself you're changing your financial situation so um, i always advise a lot of people to look into laundromats especially when you want to start out investing in a business um, laundromats remain the og when it concerns investing and yes man like my email is down in the description you can hit me up and we can partnership together we can create i can make a call with you and we'll talk on you know the inconveniences the ways to go what taxes to pay what taxes to avoid where to get the best products from and all the like so exactly um if you love this content and if you love what i do please subscribe share and hit me up and let's discuss have a great and wonderful day kudos